Hello everyone, welcome to low code bug. Let's continue our previous video. So I've configured everything and inside the save into we have this local bank input and save bank value, right? So this is showing error because we are not passing comma and now this is fine, right? So it will only work, right? It will only work when we will click on that button, right? Because if I like by mistake, if I uh, just click outside, then the integration will start running, right? That is not good. So whenever I'll click on this button, this ask button, then only it will work. So if I click test and there is nothing inside, there is no rule input. Let's remove this cancel rule input also, because if we are having any kind of rule input, then we will not be able to add this interface on our site object. So we'll delete this. There is no rule inputs now. And whenever I'm testing this empty, right, some kind of data is coming. So this is what chat GPT is returning every time. Whenever I'm hitting on this text, test, then it is running and it is returning me the random data. So uh, let's, let's not do this. This is not good. And we will only run this integration when local bank input is not null. If is null, is null or empty, we'll check if this local bank input, local bank input, if this input is null, then we are not running this. Then this will be executed, right? And when this is not null, then the integration would be executed. So now this we have built this configuration. Let's try to test this again. Now you can see this particular rich text item is coming empty. Whenever I'm clicking on test, this is coming empty, right? And when I type something, tell me about YouTube. And if I type something and I click outside, nothing is happening. But when I click on this button, ask, then the integration is running, right? And now we have the data. So this is what we want. Let's save this and let's modify this a little bit more because this rich text item, empty item is coming. When I click on test, you can see this empty section is coming. I don't want this. So, uh, I'll you show when for this particular section layout and inside this section layout we are having label contents and we'll use show when similar thing we will do whenever local bank input is null or empty not null or empty right we'll use the show when when this is not null so uh right now you can see that section is gone and this line is also coming let's see how why this line is coming and we have the label contents button everything is there okay we have used a form layout maybe that's why this particular line is coming right so let's see if we are having any parameter to remove that. So we are not having any kind of functionality like that. So let's do one thing. Let's go inside the design mode again. Because this button is not looking good. What I can do, I can add a button. After this field, I want this button. And this button array layout let's see if we are having alignment we are having yes so let's make it center margin margin we we also want the button configuration to be modified i click on this button i'll add one icon and let's change the width if I'll choose 
that's all and we are having this button i want to make this button as a round button i don't know why where we can choose that so that's all let's get back to expression mode and the configuration which we have done for this particular uh, previous button i need to do it for this button which we, i have configured now i'll pass the value i'll use a save into right so it's done and now i can remove this whole button that line was also gone right so you can see now this is looking good right just need to increase this chat gpt text so i'll click on this rich text and i can select this i can select the size large plus text now this is good let's leave it like this only for now and let's save this so let's add that interface on side quickly we have this side g game board i have built this site for tic tac toe game and i'll add this page so this page title will be chat gpt and the icon will be chat this is the interface okay and i'll make this the by default the first page i'll save this and let's see how my site is looking right now so inside the game board i have added this particular interface and this is my chat gpt right this is looking good so i'll write tell me something about chat gpt and i'll click this button you can see it is loading right and the button functionality is working properly and we have the data we have the chat gpt generative pre-trained transformer okay is an ai system designed to generate human-like conversation in natural language right so this is our output and we have this site ready we can use this whenever we are getting bored we can get inside our app and application and we can try this right so that's all for today thank you so much try it and if you are having any any doubts please ping me and thanks a lot bye bye Please like, share and subscribe.